Good morning. Welcome back, my friends. Happy Monday to you. Hope you're able to start this week off on the right foot with good intention and manifest more of the abundance that you want to see in your life. You know, the garden's a wonderful place to connect and to just get grounded and decide what it is you want to focus your intention on on this day and the next day, throughout the week, throughout the month, the year. So I'm out here this morning enjoying my cup of coffee. We've got some overcast skies. The hummingbirds are out in full force, which is always nice. Maybe we'll catch a few on film today. We'll see how friendly they want to be. <laughs> They're zipping around me. But I have got a special treat for you today, quite literally. Today is November 15th, 2021. We're in the latter part of fall, and there's still quite an abundance growing in the Plant Abundance Backyard Food Forest. So today, I'm gonna to be sharing with you some information on this little fruit right here, the persimmon. But this just isn't any persimmon. This was grown in my backyard off of a variety known as Jiro or Gyro, Fuyu persimmon. Very special variety. Many gardeners, especially growers of persimmons would agree that it's perhaps the best variety of persimmon you can grow, especially if you're just gonna grow one variety. I'm gonna share with you the details on why that is Let's go take a look at the tree. So here it is, still a young tree, but as you can see, loaded down with an abundance of fruits, which is one of the reasons this particular variety is so sought after. Although the fruits do remain quite small, that's mainly because they grow in these dense, abundant clusters, like you see here. One of the greatest benefits to this particular variety is it remains seedless if it's grown independently without another variety to cross pollinate with. You're gonna have virtually no seeds. You may find one here or there, but let's see what we find when we cut into this fruit. So it's a beautiful, crisp fruit. This is a non-astringent variety. It can be an issue with some of the other varieties that are out there. And as you can see, there's no seeds in this fruit. Mm. It really is quite delicious. So obviously, if I mentioned that it remains seedless without a cross-pollinating variety nearby, then it must be self-pollinating, right? That's correct, which is just another reason why I would recommend this particular variety, especially if you're going to be growing just one persimmon tree. And although this particular variety tends to ripen later than some of the other varieties, it can actually be enjoyed while it's still slightly green because it's a non-astringent and they hang on the tree for quite some time as well. You should get at least six weeks of hang time and the fruit will just keep on getting sweeter as time goes on. I love fruit like this that doesn't require a massive harvest all at once then I can come out here and enjoy it every time I'm in the garden. So if you're wondering if you can grow a persimmon tree where you live, well, they're hardy in USDA climate zones seven through nine. So I definitely recommend putting this one on your list. They tend to go quick. So there you have it, the Jiro or Gyro, spelt J-I-R-O, Fuyu persimmon, an easy to grow, abundant producer, self-pollinating, you can expect to start getting your harvest about three years after planting a bare root tree in your garden. So with that, my friends, I want to thank you all for watching. Have yourself a great rest of the day. Until next time, this is Dan from PlantAbundance.com. Take care. I'll be talking to you again soon.